Ecotech gives us many powerful tools that we can use to create effective shading design. Typically, we'll go through and perform some calculations to be able to understand the sun's impacts on the current state of the building. Then we can go through and start to determine the parts of the building that really need the most help. We can then go through with several different tools, uh, either just calculating or creating these shading structures interactively just by modeling, then seeing the effect that it has, or we could go through with a calculator and we could go to the shading design wizard, which allows us to create all sorts of different shapes to cover a particular window or a facade of a building. We can also go through and project or trace solar profiles onto the model, which allows us to see the path that the sun interacts with our geometry in different parts of the model. We can also project solar rays. If I go in to our rays and particles, we can define particular objects as being projectors or being able to be uh, a generator for the rays so that we can see the way that those rays are bouncing throughout the scene. By this, we can actually see the effectiveness of shading devices, louvers, different types of objects that are designed to bounce more light into a space such as a light shelf, all sorts of different things that we could visualize with the shading design tools.